Telex Free is an electronic advertising system that gives internet users an opportunity to make a profit by clicking and posting advertisements on the internet. For example, with only 339 US dollars, one can make an interest of 80 US dollars in a month. But is this like throwing your money into a national lottery? Is it a scam or is it genuine? Many questions remain abound as a few elite Ugandans have already joined Telex Free. Before one can subscribe, they are required to invest at least 700,000 shillings. In return, one starts earning a profit by posting advertisements from one website to another. Every day you publish five adverts. It's a risk thing. You, you have no agreement with these guys. So if, you, if anything happens, but anyway, uh, any other business, you have to take a risk. High risks, high returns. However, there are no regulations to protect those who take part in this online marketing from fraud. We spoke to an ICT expert who weighed in on the question of the legitimacy of some of these online marketing schemes on cyberspace. Platforms like Telex Free are seen as, um, you know, multi-level marketing channels. You know, in some countries it has worked, in other countries it hasn't worked. In other countries it's branded as, you know, something else. I, I believe that the concern about the easy money is there and, you know, a good number of people will get their, you know, fingers burnt or not. But, you know, I still leave it to the discretion of, of the individual. Fred Otunu, the Director of Competition and Consumer Affairs at the Uganda Communications Commission, said that the regulatory authority is formulating stringent regulations to ensure that users of these platforms are protected from cyberspace fraud. I must say that uh, ITU, the International Telecommunications Union, is at the forefront of coordinating several discussions and um, around such services, the OTT services. Uh, even regionally, under the auspices of uh, East Africa Communications Organization, um, to which Uganda is a member, we are also uh, in preliminary, uh, at preliminary levels of discussion uh, with, with respect to such kind of services. Asking Ugandans to be vigilant, Otuno, however, warned that the devil is in the details. In the global ICT environment, we are exposed a number of international um, innovations, transactions, which were marketing services. As a commission, we urge caution, we urge um, to consult widely before they can inject in their resources uh, without any redress that could be easily available. We also spoke to the public about their expectations in regard to Telex free marketing. It could be a nice venture for for the youth, especially the unemployed graduates, but it needs much money to invest in that business. The legitimacy is something I put to question. I am not very comfortable with that easy money concept, uh, putting in mind that a number of years ago we had um, Dutch International that ran away with people's money. What if that happened again? When we tried to contact those responsible for the recruitment, they claimed that their terms and conditions do not permit them to appear on television. Some of the recruitment training centers are located on the fifth floor of Shumuk building in Kampala and on the third floor of Ham Towers in Makerere. How to avoid fraud on cyberspace? Know who you're dealing with. Don't believe promises of easy money. Understand the offer. Resist pressure. Guard your personal information. 